Hey everybody, it's Dana with Deep Thoughts with Dana, right? Right on. So hey, I want to break something down for y'all because I make I, I say at the beginning of my readings, I say this is not your reading. This is not your personal reading. This reading may not even resonate with you at all, like everybody says, right? And I, I tell I tell people that at the beginning of my videos, and I and I'm getting these comments that say, well, if it's not my reading, why even watch online tarot at all, right? Which makes total sense, right? Here's how I'm gonna break it down. This is what a general reading is, okay? This is what a general reading is. It's like the forecast, the weather, right? The weather channel, the weatherman, whatever your weather station is, he gives a forecast, right? And let's talk local. Let's now we're not talking national or global, right? We're talking local, your town, your area. The weatherman comes on and says, Denver, Colorado has a 60% chance of rain today. That means Denver proper, and all Denver Metro, right? All around Denver Metro, just like you're probably your city. Or if you live in the country, right? It's, it's you know how much land is between each other, right? Um, so it can rain in one part of town and be sunny in another part of town. I mean, how many times is, have you seen that? I've seen it. I mean, you can look over and you can see it's just raining like crazy over there. But over here, it's sunny and beautiful. And then a few minutes later, this awesome rainbow comes in the sky. But your, yours has been sunny. They had a hell of a storm. Trees are down and limbs are blowing all over the place. But your side of town is bueno, right? So that's how, what a general tarot card reading is. It's a forecast. I mean, literally a forecast, right? Of what could possibly happen in your area. So that's the best analogy that I can use for what a general tarot card really is, right? If we're, we're reading tarot and we're, we're, we're talking about, I don't know, uh, there's something amazing going to happen in your life, right? Because that's what the cards say. Something amazing is going to happen in your life. Does that mean that something amazing is going to happen in your life? No, you could be on the side that that doesn't have the rainbow, right? But you're close enough where maybe you get a little bit of those rainbow rays, right? You understand what I'm saying? Um, and if you're in the rainbow part, then yeah, this is probably your reading. And if you want to make any big decisions based on that, you need to reach out and get a personal tarot card reading so we can zoom down to your actual location in life and tell you what that forecast is going to be, right? Right? So understand that a, a general tarot card reading, mine or anybody else's, and don't let anybody else bullshit you that this is your reading, right? And they don't. Everybody on YouTube, there's awesome readers all over YouTube. Awesome readers all over YouTube. And everybody that I've ever heard, bar none, makes some announcement about this is a general reading, right? For that very reason. And even though we know what that means as readers, right? You guys don't know what that means. I mean, how many of y'all know tarot terminology? I know some of you do because some of y'all hop on my channel and try to tell me how to read tarot cards. <laughs> so I know some of you guys have knowledge of tarot, but the bulk majority of y'all don't right? You don't. You watch, you tune in. It's fascinating. It's amazing. Maybe you learn the cards a little bit from watching the tarot card readings, right? So, so you're, yeah. Anyway, my point is that is what a general tarot card reading is, okay? It's a general forecast for this particular area of your life being your zodiac sign, right? For this particular area of your life, and you might get hit with it and you might not. And if you see yourself in there, if you see the clouds coming, you might want to roll up your windows, right? And if you see things coming a little bit closer, you might want to hop on the TV and see what kind of weather alerts are going on. And that would be your tarot card reader, right? That would be when you contact your tarot card reader and you're like, hey man, this is what's going on in my life. What is the probable outcome if everything goes as is? And when you see in that reading, the point where it turns either the direction that you like it or the direction that you don't, at that juncture is where you can intervene. That's the advantage of a tarot card reading, right? Is, is seeing what could possibly be the outcome of the situation if everybody keeps behaving the way that they do. 
right? So what is the possible outcome? That's what a tarot card reading is. And when you see yourself at that juncture and you have to make a decision about what it is you need to do to point things in the way that you would like to see them go, that's the upper hand. That's the leverage. That's the beauty. That's the blessing. Okay. Not the upper hand and the leverage. That's Detroit coming out, right? That is blessing. Okay. Now that's the Texas coming out right there. It is a blessing. So that being said, I hope you all understand that, um, that, uh, uh, the concept of a general tarot card reading. I hope that this helped you and I do hope that I see you on YouTube. Okay. Y'all have an amazing day. Namaste.